Hey, the Augusta Museum is unveiling a couple of new scavenger hunts. This is something brand new, so Will Volk had to stop it by to take on the challenge himself. The Augusta Museum of History is filled with so many things. We're constantly walking around the museum, and every time I do, something new catches my eye. Crystal Lyon started working here last summer. Since then, she's continued discovering little details all over the museum. Now she's putting some of them into two new scavenger hunts. Sometimes when you go through a museum, you're just like walking through a room, and you don't pay attention to all the posters or all the text that's on the wall. But with these scavenger hunts, you have to really be uh, an investigator or a little reporter. One, two, three, four, five. Since I'm a big reporter, I decided to take on one of the challenges. One scavenger hunt focuses on music from Augusta, and it goes beyond James Brown. The other is a second floor scavenger hunt targeted for kids, featuring a lot of counting and I spy. That is the one I did. Seven, eight. So we've tried to make it fun and exciting. Um, and a little bit hard, but also just a lot of fun. I found everything and picked up my reward, a sticker. Lion thinks you'll get another reward too, a better understanding of the museum. In Augusta, Will Volt, on your side. It is such a great place to visit, and that does help you really focus in on the contents yeah. inside. If you want to give it a try, you can go anytime the museum is open. And the scavenger hunts are included with your admission. Great way to bring history alive. To sport